You know, when it comes to choosing good, healthy stuff to eat, I have no idea what I'm doing, right? I mean, like, you <laughs> folks know this about me. Uh -huh. My family knows this. Yeah. I don't know how to shop. But when Dr. Jody from the Keto Prescription heard, she took me shopping. Oh, lucky. You went shopping with Dr. Jody? Yes. Well, you went. Shut the we went, front door. We went to Ala Moana's Food Land Ooh. Farm. Wow. So check this out. Every time Dr. Jody Nishida joins us on Island Life Live with the Keto Prescription, we all learn some things. How are you doing, Dr. Jody? Good morning. Uh, good morning. Okay, so you're going to teach me how to shop and how to shop keto style, right? The Keto Prescription style. Yes, well, healthy in general. You know, people don't really know how to navigate the grocery store as well as they think, or they need to have their habits changed. Absolutely. So we're standing here in front of a green wall. Yes. <laughs> a green wall of Very goodness, green. right? Yes. <laughs> Tell us about some of the things that we should be choosing in the produce area. Okay. And produce is always the first stop in a grocery store when you walk in. And so if you look here, these are some great local examples of healthy vegetables. The darker leafy green and not pre-packaged, the better off you're going to be. What, why is that? The pre-packaged salads and bags and plastic containers go through a chlorine rinse. Ooh, I didn't know that. And then that chlorine gets into your system, and that's not the best thing for your gut bacteria. I know that you've got a system about the perimeter. Tell me about that. So that's what we're gonna do today, is produce, meats, eggs and dairy, and then you get your butt out of the store. <laughs> Shut the perimeter and get out. <laughs> about how long should a person be in a supermarket? If they have a plan and they've got their list of ingredients, yeah. really how long should we be here? That's a great question. 15 minutes. Really? Yeah. Can we do this in 15 minutes? Easy. Awesome. Okay. <laughs> we got to go try it then. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> Dr. Jody tasked me to find a lean cut of meat that was about a half pound. Yep. How did I do? He did good looking at the weight mm -hmm. on the labeling, so 0.56 pounds. Yeah. And then it doesn't have tons of fat throughout, right? Because clean keto is not super fatty meat like everyone thinks. And then just so everyone can see, like for scale, right? I got a Sharpie. It's about that long long, that tall, and then looking at the thickness of it. And so what I want you to do, and what I want most people to do, is to eat about a half a pound of meat or protein at lunch and dinner. Lunch and dinner. Yeah. Got it. Now, tell me a little bit about what happens in the egg and dairy section. What are the things that we're looking for there? Real butter. Real butter? Not what? margarine. Oh! Okay. Not, I can't believe it's not butter. Real butter is the best thing for you. And then things like full fat Greek yogurt. Full fat? Full fat, not low fat because low fat means it has more sugar. Yeah. I automatically am thinking I'm, I'm going to try and lose weight. I'm going to take off some pounds, go for fat free, go for low fat. But we're trying to avoid the sugar. Yes. Always remember, eat fat to lose fat. Low fat means more sugar. Sugar makes you gain fat. Okay, so we're going to keep it really clean today when we're Very shopping. Very clean. Dr. Jody with the Keto Prescription, teaching us how to shop the perimeter of any supermarket. Good stuff, right? All right, let's do this. Okay. That is so amazing. I really learned a lot. Usually I buy um, that the triple wash spinach from Costco. I guess that's the question now. What are they washing with? Yeah, what are they with? washing with? Is so it that regular is regular water or chlorine water? And of course, you guys saw I got busted in the cookie aisle. But anyway, <laughs> I'm, I'm learning. Hooky Lena, like Mary, where are you going, Mary? <laughs> Man, that is. Thank you so much, Dr. Jody.